former deputy tourism minister under the erstwhile Mahama administration, lawyer Elizabeth Ofosu Ajari, is determined to be the first woman to represent the people of the Techima North constituency in parliament. At the launch of the party's 2020 constituency campaign held in Chobodom, the former deputy minister highlighted a number of projects she single-handedly executed as a candidate. As I tour around the constituency as a candidate, I continue to affect the socio-economic lives of our constituents. As a woman and a mother, I cannot look on how our people battle with basic social problems. In the last one year, I have provided our people health, sports, skills development, agriculture, education. Oh. Oh. Notable oh. about the things that I've, I've done include a 10-seater water closet toilet facility at Tuodom Dome Pass. Yeah. Yeah. A mechanized borehole at Asemenu. A biodigester toilet facility at Poem Health Center. Yeah. With repeating of about 30 boreholes around the constituency. Wow. I have donated cement and other building materials for the renovation of Okuman Police Station. Madame Elizabeth Ejari promised to establish a scholarship scheme to cater for brilliant but needy students from basic to the tertiary level in honor of her late father, I.K. E.J. Mensa. We will aggressively pursue programs that are people-centered. The aim is to develop the human capacity of our people, create wealth for them, and ultimately improve the living standards of our constituents. Elizabeth Ofosu Ejari, as a member of parliament, will initiate an IK EJ Mensa scholarship scheme in collaboration with Ghana Education. Yes, but needy students from basic to tertiary institution. This scholarship is in honor of my late father, your father, our grandfather, Honorable IK. She also promised to sponsor two ladies annually to study law as a means of converting the Techima North constituency into a hub for female lawyers. Personally, this is a personal pledge to the people of Techima North. I will ensure that every year I will sponsor two ladies to study in the area of law. Wow. It is my dream that in a few years to come, there will be a lot of young, brilliant, shining lawyers from Techman North. One level. To the extent where it will be a hub for excellent female lawyers. Key amongst the tall list of community development projects the NDC candidate will be pursuing is the completion of the Asue Mesedan Boyam Roads. My topmost priority will be to fix Mesedan Boyam Asue Roads. Mrs. Ofusu Ajari assured the constituents that she will capitalize on her experience as a former minister to attract the needed developmental projects for the area. Given my professional background, experience as a former minister for tourism, culture, and creative arts, wow. and dedicated studies and interaction with my constituents, I present myself to you, my constituents, to allow me to be a big voice for the people of Techima North. The NDC candidate faces a stiff contest from the incumbent member of parliament who doubles as the deputy Bono East Regional Minister Martin Oti Jaco on December 7. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Chobodon.